I'm Bob Holmark in Hawkins today as part of the oil festival weekend here at the Red Rooster in Hawkins there is going to be an auction an auction to benefit some kids that we have become very familiar with over the years and to talk about those kids right now we're joined by the uh, ag teacher at Hawkins ISD Matt Bird the bird man joins us right now hey hey uh, well, tell, tell us what's uh, going to be going on. We're going to be having an auction to, uh, I guess, benefit uh, your kids. Is that right? That's right. This is our, our biggest event of the year. It's, uh, it's our, our, for our FFA and uh, everything that we auction off or a lot of projects our students have built. We've got a lot of items that were donated and all the funds. This is really how we get through the school year and, and all the projects that we build. It funds that when we travel, uh, hotels, meals, uh, entry fees. And then past that, really our scholarships. That's that's a big part of what we do. Uh, we, we give back to our kids. So all this money is is, is raised by them, for them, and, and that's our goal is to be able to support them in our program. All right, now Matt mentioned that the, there was some items that were donated. We're gonna show you some pictures here and also some items built by his kids out there. Uh, I'm guessing you have no, there's a lot of stuff that has been donated here. I mean, was that a really a surprise that you got so much here? You know, I, we're, we're blessed to have a great community and surrounding communities that, that love to give to this auction. Uh, it's become a big event now. It's uh, right after the oil festival's over in the afternoon. This is kind of where everybody comes. They, we give them a free meal. Uh, Red Rooster, uh, they've always been our, a big supporter of us and, and host us every year. And, and we'll get a lot of people out here. They'll, they'll probably be 350 to 400 tonight. Um, so, so it's awesome, and yeah, a lot of great donated items. Uh, the shop projects itself, uh, uh, we had 96 shop projects built, and there was about 12 of those that were built before school started. So, uh, kind of do the math there. So, in the past six weeks, we've been really busy. Our students have been at it uh, seven days a week, late nights, weekends. That's what it takes to get it done. So, uh, we, we've been busy. So, we're looking forward to it. Hoping for a great auction tonight. Uh, hope everybody comes out and sees us, and, and I think we got something for everybody. Okay. Now, uh, you, you, there are a lot of items here that are very high dollar. I don't know if you have a goal set for this, but I mean, there's some very high dollar items out here and I'm hoping, I'm guessing you hope people put bids on those oh, you know, yeah. well and above. Well, you know, and that's one thing, you know, we, we spend a lot of money to build a lot of these projects. And so we depend on this auction, that money goes right back into that account. And that's what starts us over again. So, mm -hmm. so we got some really, really nice stuff here. And uh, mm -hmm. there's four projects here that we show at the Houston Livestock Show all received blue ribbons, all four of them actually placed in the top five of their class, so that's exciting. So we want someone to get, take a piece of this home and, and have a quality project, something they're gonna be proud of, and we're proud that we were able to build it and put it out there. And this is all about the kids, obviously. Uh, this is uh, to build a better future and to have a better future for these kids, scholarship money, things of that nature. That's right. Uh, it wouldn't be possible if we didn't have some really outstanding kids in the FFA. Program. I tell you, we're, we're blessed at Hawkins. We've got some of the hardest working kids you can find. I know we ask a lot of them. Uh, we depend on them, and, and like I said, this is for them. And so they, they know the, the buy-in and, and the product that we're trying to push and put out there, and, and so they, they buy into it. And, and we don't have to really stretch ourselves so thin because we know that they're going to show up and, and put in the work and do the time. And, and that's a rarity, I think, this day and time. And so we're blessed to have great kids and families here at Hawkins. I couldn't ask for a better group of kids to work with. So we're, uh, we're extremely proud of them and everything that they've done. All right, Matt, I appreciate it. Yeah, you bet. Thank Best you. Best of luck to you. Yes, sir. All right, man. We'll have more on this story tonight on KLTV 7 News for KLTV Web Extra. I'm Bob Holmark.